Welcome to Popcorn Planet. I'm Andy Signor, and we are live. Breaking news just dropped. Uh, I'm here with Lewis of Nerd Report. We've had a lot of guests. We've been talking a lot of speculation, but it's time to put it all to bed because FBI Denver has just confirmed minutes ago that a comparison of dental records confirms that the human remains found at the Team Avery Carlton Reserve uh, and Environmental Park are those of Brian Laundry. A uh, comparison of these records uh, confirm it. Uh, the FBI's tremendous investigative support from our partners at Northport, et cetera, et cetera, uh, finally confirming what a lot of us had figured was going to happen. However, today, after we talked about the evidence and things that were contaminated so much, even though this is it, Brian is found. We don't need to keep the search for Brian any further. It is now confirmed, guys. There's no more theories needed. We got to put this part of it to bed. Uh, Brian is officially in that reserve. His remains were there. The next questions are going to be how, why, what caused this? Uh, did the parents know? There's still a lot we need to figure out regarding this case. However, I want to seriously just tell you the truth, and that's what it is. We also are told here, Brian Etten reported that the two that about 28 minutes ago, uh, when we taped this, uh, detectives went in the laundry house. They were inside for two minutes or less, and then they walked out and left. Uh, they have now apparently been formed that the remains are Brian's, according to their attorney. So uh, now that this has gotten out there, it clearly the FBI timed this around the same time. They were told we were told we weren't going to find this out today. However, it looks like they did. Uh, the speculation all day, Lewis, has has lot wild theories because the way the the FBI, the police, have handled this, they did some weird press conference earlier, just patting themselves on the back, which was way too early. Uh, the way they've bundled this whole thing has been very frustrating because, again, remember, and we talked about this earlier, it was these two that found the body. If it wasn't for them getting back out there and doing it, we we wouldn't have had this happen. So it's 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 just. I, I'm still reacting to a lot of this because um, the fact that they, they were out there and, and, and 30 minutes in after finally checking the reserve, I, I'm, I'm still stunned by this sort of craziness in this case of how it all wrapped. But at the same time, I'm not surprised. Uh, I think too many people, myself included, I got guilty of at certain points. Thanks to all of you guys as we did this journey together. We were... Our imaginations were going wild, Lewis, you know what I mean? And we had too many ideas and places that it was going. Uh, but today, it's it's hard to deny it, and I want to get your thoughts ne next. And I want to get you guys in the comments, let you know your thoughts. We're going to go back live. Uh, Lewis, I mean, I, I think we got as we got we to gotta take this as what it is. The, the case is closed. Brian Laundrie is found. He is dead. How he died, we will find out. But you agree. There's no, there's no more conspiracy theories we should even humor at this point. What are your thoughts? Exactly. No more conspiracy theories. Uh, I just want to, you know, there's a lot of disappointment um, expressed with our comments and stuff like that. And nothing's going to bring Gabby back. And that's, that's the thing until, I mean, there's a part of me that says until we could have that kind of news, like we, she's, she was, she never passed away or whatever. Uh, she was never murdered. Uh, we're not going to be satisfied uh, and stuff like that. So we got to like, just be careful as a community is that, not to uh, keep searching for that, you know, unobtainable uh, goal, right? So now we know uh, Brian's gone and uh, a lot of people died with him. His, his parents are never going to be the same. Gabby's parents are never going to be the same. Gabby's friends are not going to be the same. Uh, and, you know, so, yeah, there's a lot of casualties here uh, that we got to take into consideration and stuff and it's true of, i mean the audience i feel in the comments as we're live i mean the it, this if this has affected so many people so many people related yeah listening to that those the, the tape uh by the cops the body cam footage etc so many people related to this poor w w woman we lost way too soon my heart goes out to her and her family uh it's just it's this is not the outcome we predicted and and, and no at the end of the day uh I have a lot of questions. I have a lot of questions, but most of my questions right now are aimed at the police. Um, how did they not search this area sooner, if that's the case? And, then, and I think still so many people, Lewis, they don't trust the laundries. They don't no. trust the laundries. Now, again, I got to stand with, this is not a time to go protest their house like some of the scumbags that are out there doing it. This Let give them peace right now. Let them deal with this. Uh, we will... I'm sure get opportunities to learn more in the coming weeks. The lawyer has clearly implied they will talk at some point. It seems it seems they will get some sort of interview with some big outlet. I'm sure they'll get paid uh, whether people like that or not. I think people want answers and sadly, they're the only two people that can give us answers right now. We're going to have to be a little bit patient and see what happens. Uh, 
I, I, we were we were going through so many theories throughout the stream that to me now we're all just throw them out the window. Um, th there's theories I have as to how this happened, where he went, but I, I think we will get more information. Some people say we won't. You know, we were having animal experts and people like if these remains were badly damaged due to the terrain or the wildlife, we won't. We may not even know what actually happened. So uh, this may be a big disappointment for many. Uh, but at the end of the day, it's closure in one way. It's closure of we can stop looking for bald guys. We can stop this hunt for mm -hmm. Brian Laundry. Is this him? Is that him? It's done. It's over. This will quiet that story a lot. Uh, and uh, I think we that wanted we wanted something else. I, I feel you. We wanted uh, hey, a lot of us wanted Dog the Bounty Hunter car chase on TV. Grab Brian, kick the shit out of him, and take him to uh, you know take him to court and getting life and stuff like that. But uh, yeah, it's, it's anticlimactic and it's not going to, uh, you know, satisfy people's thirst. I feel you. Um, we're all the same, but we're all in this together and, and stuff like that. So let's, uh, what we could do is moving forward, reach out to people, reach out to your friends that you haven't talked to in a long time. Uh, if you sense there's a relationship is going wrong, reach out to that person, go, Hey, are you okay? Don't be aggressive. Cause people are usually, standoffish uh with things like that you know when you start to ask them or question a relationship they're in that seems toxic maybe it isn't toxic but go in there and ask anyways you know hey everything good with you reach 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 for your friends man or, or your family that you haven't spoken to in a while no well said and the other thing is obviously the, the gabby petito foundation is one that's still uh, there and, and will be doing a lot of yeah. good i hope you guys can go support that as you should. In honor what of a Gabby, beautiful picture with the with the angel. Yeah, uh, in honor of Gabby and uh, this being DV Awareness Month, we're holding a special uh, uh, stream uh, next Thursday. I'm going to put it in the pinned comment link. So when you watch this, check the pinned comment. I'd love for you to go click Remind Me and join us there because we're going to have a lot of survivors that Gabby's story has affected. Uh, a lot. It's going to be. A, we're going to bring a lot of people together. And at this point, as we try to get some closure and try to get answers. Uh, I do think we should put our powers to good uh, and uh, learn from this and help some other people hopefully not get in this situation and next time walk away from the relationship, which it seems like this could have all been avoided. There were so many opportunities, Lewis, where this all just could have been avoided. That's why it's so heartbreaking mm -hmm. for me and I know others. And I'm, I've, we've been, this is another long day of stream as we've been talking about this with, uh, uh, with you guys. But Man, it's just been an up and down, and I'm sure I know a lot of you have reached out personally to sort of share your your frustrations and emotions. But we've been on this, following this so closely. I think we have gotten sometimes too invested and too imaginary. Uh, but right now, guys, the reality is it's over. It's over for now. Brian's the, the hunt for Brian is done. Now the justice is still going to be ongoing. How what the justice means, how we get our information, who knew, why, how did the police mess up. All those questions, I think. How, why do the Utah Moab police know, they know do better? How do we make sure they do better in the future? There's a lot to be done from this case. Uh, and so much love and positivity and prayers to the Petitos because I'm sure this has got to hurt. So this is not the outcome they wanted. They wanted answers, and this isn't going to give them the answers they thought. It's not going to give any of us the answers we want. Uh, but sometimes life doesn't give you answers. Um, anyway, I, I, I'm at a loss. When I'm at a loss, I ramble. I don't want to ramble too much. I want to make sure we got this news for you. Uh, to confirm again, the remains are Brian Laundry. I see people in the chat saying, well, how do we know the dental records are, are his? Guys, I, it's got to be attached to a skull. I, I think it's time to put this to bed. Uh, yeah. This has happened. And, Lewis, it makes the most sense. This guy was not the skilled, you know, survivor no, man. He, he was a uh, – he, 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 his, his – his, uh, Look, look at Gabby. She is, she looked like a beautiful person. She was positive. Like she had a beautiful smile and look what he did to her. That's like a coward way. If he was upset in a relationship, he could have just walked away. But what did he do? He's a coward. If she was, she wouldn't have done. He, he's a coward, man. He, he wasn't that skilled to survive in the wilderness and stuff like that. We gave him too much credit. Uh, man, look, look at the end of the day, we can't fix or change the past, but we can help out in the future. So let's work. Let's work with that. Everyone here watching the, the community here at Popcorn Planet, uh, new, newcomers, let, let's uh, be a force for good in the future. Pick up that phone. I'm telling you, that's really important. Call someone you haven't spoken to in a long time, right? And, and ask them, how are you? Don't text. 
texting if you if you can't if, if texting's the only uh resource you have then so be it but try to talk to somebody we need more interaction with people see if they need help we and all stuff. we need more well friendship said. we all got a chance and yeah. thank you to all this community i hope we'll we stick around as we report try to figure out the qu answers to the questions that i know so many of you have in this chat why what how, when, when how, all that stuff i hope we will get the answers to uh but let's try to use all we well we all united for a reason i think the universe works in strange ways and i think you and i all of us this community met for a reason and i hope we can mm -hmm. continue to ride this uh this wave that we're on to do more positivity to do more good to raise more awareness and uh have some fun too. Uh, let's build this community. We all got to get outside. We've been so absorbed with this, guys. It's, this is not the day to do it. I get, but get off the computer, log off, go see your family. Like Lewis said, call a friend. Get go for a walk, do something. I know some of us get so absorbed on these news stations and uh, even our streams. Uh, we gotta we gotta do some positivity too, and, and try to, to remember what's really matters. And right now, there's two families mourning. Don't forget that there are two families mourning right and now. And many casualties, not just physically, but but there's a lot of life, lives are changed forever. Innocent bystanders we probably don't know about. Uh, me, Patty's, uh, Gabby's, sorry, his friends, um, you know, they, they no, I mean, they'll never be the uh, same. Rose, they've been bothering Rose for weeks. And everyone, oh, you were in on this. You were, Guys, this part of the piece, this, the story is over. We don't need to look for Brian. It's over. Mm. Now we need to figure out why, what happened, and we need to all figure out how to move on and use what we've learned from this story on to the next one. How do we help our friends? Like Lewis said, yep. how do we do it? And, and I hope you will help us uh, two ways you can help immediately go support the Gabby Petito foundation. First and foremost, uh, that family deserves it and they are looking to turn this into a positive. And I think you, you can't say any better than that. If they can help some other family, given all the light they got shined on this case, if they can use that attention right now to help us find others. Well, that's a good cause. Uh, and then we will be doing a stream next Thursday. 100% of the proceeds will go to a shelter here in Tampa Bay. That's very important. And we're going to be sharing a lot of stories. I hope you will tune in. I will put that again in the pinned comment down there. Uh, and again, if you want to uh, continue to watch us, we're here daily live every 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Uh, please hit that subscribe. Uh, hit that bell for alerts and smash the like button. Look, I know a lot of you guys are disappointed, but this is the facts. We got to get used to it. Uh, we'll yeah. be back tomorrow to take more of your calls and thoughts as we wrap up this stream. Uh, but thank you for watching with us and, and breaking the news with us. I wouldn't want any other way. This community has been incredible, Lewis, and I'm so uh, happy to have met all you guys. I'm yep. sad right now. I'm frustrated. I'm just trying to keep it together to do this. But guys, confirmed, FBI Denver, Brian, the hunt is over. Uh, tell us what you think down below. Catch us tomorrow. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're watching live, don't go anywhere. We'll wrap up in a second. Appreciate all you guys.